Hello my friends, we're here, we're settled in, let me take you on a little tour. This is uh, my apartment, I showed you it last time, we're renting out a room in a guest house. Uh, it's got all the amenities, it's got a mini fridge, it's got a kettle that you have to ask for, but that's not a problem, I only like one cup of tea a day. Um, it's got a big screen TV, in fact I can show you, that's just uh, just behind me there. Big screen TV, as you can see. Um, Apparently so, and uh, yeah, so that, this is my apartment, not too much to see yet, we're not fully moved in with the missus yet, so, but let me take you to the stadium, because it's amazing. So welcome to the stadium, obviously I, I take my office chair everywhere I go, because I like to sit down because I'm lazy, so that's why I'm still in my chair at the stadium, but as you can see, beautiful pitch, look at the big stand, uh, move out of the way, look, look at the giant stand we've got there, 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 there. That, that's our stand there. It's good, isn't it? Beautiful place. It's basically sort of Wembley-esque, I would say, um, in its makeup. Uh, but let me show you a few other things around the beautiful town of Karlovo. I remember the name now. I've got it. So this is one of the beautiful streets in Karlovo. Beautiful in the foothills of the mountains. It's, it's just a beautiful place to be. Again, take me off, yeah? It's fine. Just, just ignore that. should paint it green, probably. That's just how lazy I am. <laughs> Can't even be asked to get off the chair to record. No, no. Uh, and just for you guys, you know, just to show you that I'm on trend. <laughs> All right, guys, great mannequin challenge. All right, yeah. Yeah, you can move now. No, you can move now. Brilliant. Good work. Good work, everybody. <music> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode 12 of The Journeyman. And we're settling in well at Carlovo. I'm still having to remember it before I say it. It's still not coming quite there. Right. We made a few signings. We played a couple of games today. It's Cup Day. Hooray. Right, so let's have a look at what we've done so far. We've just played a few games. So after our uh, one nil win after, over Locomotive Sofia, we drew televised match. By the way, because um, we're we're a big draw, uh, as you can see from the pitch. You know, like our stadium's amazing. Um, Sempteri Turval. We drew with them one all. Uh, Zappers getting a late penalty equaliser for us. Very happy with that. But then we beat, and this is a good one, because they were the one of the teams that we turned down the job for when we picked Karlovo. Fuck me. 4-2 um, we beat them. Zappers with the goal. Stefanov, Atenzo, and Tiliev, the, the youngster, the 18-year-old that we spent all our money on, scored a goal. Really good run from defensive midfield, deep-line playmaker role, all the way up the pitch, scored a goal. So... May that long, may that continue and all that stuff. Then we played Sozopol, lovely name, loving it. 2-1 win, a Baydakov brace. He played really well. This is, is He had a little knock in the, in the previous game, didn't play, and then came back, scored his first two goals, loving life. And then a really disappointing result against uh, Etar, 2-0, uh, and they... they were down the bottom of the league, and they slaughtered us. They, it, was, it was disgusting. Let's have a look at the match stats. Um, it's not pretty reading, is it? It's not pretty reading at all. So, yeah, that, that didn't quite work. Um, but today we are playing Lokomotive Gorna in the Bulgarian first round. They are the first league preliminary phase, the division below, I believe. And then we're going to play Bansko. Uh, Bansko. Bansko, even. Bansko. Um, Transfer-wise, we have bought in a few players. Um... One, one is, is a few now. It's a new term. Um, Ginaldi, Ginadi, Alberto Lugo. Alberto Lugo, something we can pronounce. There's main reason for buying him, but actually he's a really good right winger. He can also play right back, but interestingly, marking of one, tackling of two. So let's call him an offensive right back option, but he's mainly a winger. And I think he's better than his, the scouts say he is, and he's been proven to be all right in his prime, 28 years old now. Uh, one thing I need to look at is just if we've, if we've let any of these guys go that's any good that we might be able to sign back. Um, doesn't look like it, does it? 
I think that was an optimistic... Yeah. Okay, moving on. I got told in real life, um, they're bottom of the league, uh, nine games, nine defeats. So the fact we're sitting comfortably in ninth place with ten points, very, very happy with. The board are happy, everybody's happy, apart from the bankers. Uh, they're not happy with us. But it's good. We're fine. We're going to go in today. We're playing the cup game. Uh, Alberto Lugo is cup tied, so we're going to play Kidev um, as our right winger. Harry Owen on the bench. Should he, I wonder if we play him in the cups. Should we play him in the cups? So the formation-wise, this is what we've been using up until last game. And then it went horribly wrong. And we lost 2-0 against like shitty team. Um, and I'm, I'm debating whether to drop to this. Uh, I still ha haven't decided the full. I think I think we're going to go. F no, we will stick to. I'm in captain. Captain decisive here. Um, I think we're going to go for that team. Um, just because it's won all the previous games. That was just a, a one-off, right? Please be a one-off. Um, with uh, Baydakov, Stefanov. There we go. Baydakov up front. All good to go. Everybody's fit, raring to go. Let's fucking do this, you bitches! Right. Just like to say, a little bit of a plug here. Tonight at 6 pm, I'm recording a radio interview with um, Cardiff Radio because I'm going to be featured on Cardiff Radio, like their talk sport thing, um, between 2 and 3 pm on Saturday. Loki, shut up, mate. I'm advertising shit here. Yeah, so that's a weird. I got a tweet from them said, Do you want to come on and talk about your blog? And I was like, Okay. It's, it's a bizarre situation. Um, I haven't got the heart to tell them I've actually left to go to leave, live in Bulgaria. Uh, but we'll have a chat about it and it might be on the radio on Saturday. So who knows? Some people have labelled your team as potential giant killers. Wait. Aren't we... Wait. Aren't we above them in the leagues? Okay. I'm a little bit worried now. Wait. Wait. We're playing Locomotive Gorner, right? They're in the first league preliminary... Preliminary... Mirror. Oh, no, they are. Oh, no, that is the top one. Shit. Where are they? Yeah, they are. I thought it's because it's called preliminary. It's probably because it splits in two. does some weird shit, doesn't it? Oh, crap, and we've gone attacking. Oh, fuck it. Fuck it. Mate, oh no, we've gone, we're using the counter. That's all right. That's all right. Um, passionately tell them, give the seven fans a performance to cheer for. Let's do this. Mm, we need faith. We we need baby cheeses now because otherwise we're screwed. Come on, baby cheeses! Right here we go. Look, the stadium looks a bit better in game than it does in real life. I have to admit that it does. You know, it's close, just a little bit worse in real life. Um, yeah, same again, lads. Same again. M maybe with a goal this time. Same, but with a goal. Okay, so, so different. Admittedly, that's different. But you know what I mean. Are we going to get a single highlight this game? Tilev is looking a little bit tired, so I think we're going to have to take him off. 15 minutes le yeah, left, and we haven't had a single fucking highlight. Do we? Fuck it. Fuck it. Go on, Harry Owen! Everybody's saying, oh, you got to name him Owen of, or something. I'm like, I'm not making names more complex. We're trying to make them easier. Owen's easy. Right, are we going to get a highlight that's not the the sort of final whistle? Hi oh! We've got a highlight, and it's ours, hopefully. No, it's theirs, isn't it? Win it. Okay. He's not even going to try and win the header. He just runs off in the opposite direction. Amazing. Right. Wow. We waited 86 minutes for that, people. 86 minutes. That was it. That, that, was, that was the highlight. Right. Extra time. We've got a, we have got a substitute left. <clears throat> the defence has been rock solid, so we're not going to touch that unless we have to. Um, our defensive midfielders. He's a little bit tired. So, oh, what, what did I say? Keep it up. Lost in translation. Um, I think we'll just get rid of the tired one then, I guess. Come on, boys. Um, we basically don't want to go to penalties because we have, like, 
three good penalty takers and the rest might as well be blind elephants taking penalties after that. Oh, go away, phone. Oh, no. No. Oh, what? Oh, he's made an amazing tackle. He's made an amazing tackle and it's gone straight to for Tihilmo Kanev. That is unfortunate. If... Where did they get all the shots from? What? what? Look. Look at this tackle. Oh, it's an amazing tackle. <laughs> Savoff. Uh, might have to call him Savile. Would that be a mistake? <sighs> Looks like they've turned it on. The extra fitness is paying dividends. We've cleared it away, but I'm not sure what... No, he's not going to bother trying for it. No, okay. Nikolov's picked it up. He's played it all the way back to the keeper like a big pansy. Right, f 15 minutes left, people. Harry Owen, I'm not sure if he's touched the ball. Um, we're going to gamble, push up a little bit, use the offside trap. We might as well change something. Oh, we did so well until extra time, and we've been slaughtered in extra time. There's been highlights and everything. Ten minutes left. Is this our chance? It could be. It could be. We'll take a corner goal. Set piece. Go on. Yes! Avramov! Come on, Ivalio Avramov. <laughs> With his first of the second of the season. Well, it's one of his goals of the season. Lovely ball into the back post. Like we worked on in training. Keepers just flapping about. Waving it goodbye. And it's one all. Come on, boys. We're going for the winner. Fuck it. Mainly because I'm too lazy to change it back. But that's fine. Denshev. Header on, but nobody's there to collect it. Hoofed away. Win it. Win it. Oh, my God. Just try and get it. Just try and get it. Oh, no. I hate back passes. They're better than last year, but it still makes me wee a little bit. Those back passes. Oh, look at this. Beautiful play. Look at it. Oh, really? Really? Oh, no. I shouldn't have started that. I feel like that was my fault. Here we go. Oh no, there's the ball that we were da that's dangerous. Kanev, come on, keeper. Yes, he's missed it. <laughs> Two minutes left. Oh, it's going to look like we got penalties, boys. I'll take it. I'll take it. Penalties against the superior opposition. I'll take. Oh, two, sorry. I lied. I lied. We have no good penalty takers. Our best penalty taker has eight penalties. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's. It's not ideal, I'd say. Um, in the, I'm not even going to pick players. It doesn't really matter. We've got a good Denchev in goals. Decent goalkeeper. Come on. Oh, he's almost saved that. He's he's not happy with himself. Come on, Stevanov. Stevanov, come on, do it for me. Do it for me. Oh, that is a wonder save. He went the wrong way and then went. <laughs> it'll tickle. Fair play. That was a good save. Come on, Denchev, you've got to make it. You've got to do one. Okay, just fall over in where you're standing. That's fine as well. Zappers, he's already scored two penalties this season, so I'm confident. Well, I enjoyed the cup run. It was good. <laughs> oh, no. We've got to score this. Any chance at all. This will be the most pathetic penalty shootout in your life if we miss this. Yes! Yes! And we've got to save this. Come on, Denchev. You've got this. This is it. This is your moment. This is the spotlight. Do something. You're our best player. Yes! Get in there! Still in it, boys. Straight down the middle. Mind you, that's the first one that Owen... Oh, no. It's Harry Owen. It's Harry Owen. Oh, no. I knew he was going to miss. I knew he was going to miss. <laughs> Why did it have to be Harry Owen? Why? Oh no! Tell everyone there was a lot of positives on show. Fair enough, we took them to penalties. We really pushed them all the way. I do feel proud. Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, why? Why did it? Why did it have to be Harry Owen? Was it? To be fair, was it any? It was always going to be him, wasn't it? It was always going to be him that fucked it up. I'm so annoyed. Right. Let's get straight in. Forget that. Moving on. 
There was definite positives to show. I think fitness was the big thing. We pretty much held them 90 minutes, and then the extra time, it, it, they just ate us alive. So, okay, yep, yep, positives, yep, yep. I'm signing another player, people. I'm signing... Look, look, cheeky, look at this cheeky little pickup. One of my scouts actually found him. I couldn't bloody believe it. They're all full of scouting. He can really jump. Jumping's good, right? 120 quid a week. I think that is a cheeky bargain, that is. Uh, 25 years old. So still a little bit of time to improve. Just strengthens our midfield options. Fans are pleased. Of course they are. I'm a fucking, ta I'm a fucking transfer genius. Right. Bansco, we can do this. I'd like to know in the comments, does anyone use this tactical summary? Because whatever formation I'm playing, whatever team instructions I'm playing, whether I've just won 100 games in a row or lost 100 games in a row, they will tell me to change pretty much everything in my formation. Every game. So fuck them. Basically, that's my thoughts on the matter. Fuck them. Hopefully, we should hit 5,000 subscribers tonight. It'll be pretty amazing. I think we should do something. Should we do a Q&A? Does anybody want a q and A? I I know they're a bit dull, aren't they, Q&As? To be fair, the last q and I did live stoned from Amsterdam. That made it a bit more fun. But if you guys want a Q&A, please do let me know and, and we can, we can organise one. And it's like a no-holds-barred Q&A. None of this boring shit. Who's your favourite footballer? No, no, none of that shit. Get stuck in. But let me know if you want one, guys, and we'll we'll get organised at the weekend and do one. Do one, yeah? I, I've also made this um, my Loki Doki squad view. A few people have asked about it. Um, I've made that available on Steam Workshop, so you can just go into Steam Workshop... Um, on Steam, I was going to say, um, and just type in Loki Doki, and this this squad view will come up. It's really useful. It's got all the sort of stuff you need on it. it saves you having to build it yourselves. Um, if you want to use the same one as me, go ahead and do that because it is actually quite useful. All right, Filipov, Stefanov's a bit knackered. Um, the centre backs a bit knackered. How many under twenty ones? We got two, so we need to replace him with an under twenty one. That's all good. The new man's here. That's not that. Oh my god, that's not the new man. That's that, please don't let that be the new man. There he is. I haven't registered him. One of the good things about Bulgarian football is if free transfers, you can register at any point. So you, if you if you get an injury crisis, pick a free player up. Really, really <laughs> handy to do that is. Um, and we shall put him on the bench. Speaking slowly, like I can't multitask. It's not a thing I can do. I can just about talk and play. Right. As you can see, Tilev, five games, one goal, playing 7.2. He's tearing it up at the moment. He's loving life at the mighty... I don't know what the stadium's called. What's the, anybody, what's the stadium called? Wait, we're not in Karlovo? Is that a bigger place? Um... <gasps> What? What's this? Wait. So we must... I'm, conf I'm, I'm confused now. So we're in a 5,000-seater stadium. All-seater, right? Which the picture didn't make it look all-seater, did it? But due to move into a 2,000-capacity, Vasil Levski on the 10th of the 1st, 2018. Now, I'm no maths genius, but I think that one we're moving to is quite a bit smaller. I feel like it's a bad way to go. It's it's probably, I think, maybe Hisar is where we're playing at the moment and we're moving into a local stadium. But still, that's kind of annoying, mind you. Mind you, saying that, what's our sort of attendance like? 118 people. I don't think we've got to worry about it. <laughs> I don't think we've got to worry about the five th missing out on the 3,000 seats, guys. It's not a thing. Uh, probably 2,000 will help with the atmosphere, I think. Right. Let's, let's pretend we never saw that and pretend we get big crowds. That's awful. That's so bad. Right. We're sort of Cardiff Met Uni levels of attendance. Um, 
Okay, let's say my favourite. So I want to see if this this tactic can break them down. We're going to go um, standard or attacking. We're not going to keep it counter. I don't know who that is. Um, he's just been rested. Um, I don't think he's very far off. That's the new guy. Okay, so we're, we're not we're going to go attacking. I think we come out of the blocks, smashing them up. We are favourites here, so go out and press me. Okay, I have faith in you. I have faith in you, and I've got faith in you. Go, boom, job. Yeah, I, I definitely don't think this is our stadium. It all makes sense now. <laughs> I don't know what that image is for, for that I showed you at the beginning, because it even it wasn't even two thousand seats, was it? It was more like one hundred and fifty seats ish. Maybe that's where they're building the stadium. Who knows? Who knows? We'll find out in two thousand eighteen. See what it looks like. <clears throat> Okay, so the big question of the day is, will this formation be able to beat the lesser teams? Otherwise, we need to have a second formation that we switch to for the shitty games. Right, Kirov. Right, him. Twanzvarov. He's going the wrong way. Don't let him know that. Lefterov. Kostov. He's crowded out by Nick Tov, but somebody Ov's got it else. Ov's got it. Ov passes to Ov. I'm going to guess he's going to pass to Ov. Yes, called it. I called that. He's going to. I think he's going to knock it to Ov. Or he's just going to run away. Yes. Oh, great tackle, flip Ov. Baydakov back to flip off. Flip off makes the run. He's waiting for the overlap, but they didn't come. Tilev. Oh, it's the youngster. He bags his second. Get in there, Ivan Tilev. I can even pronounce his name. That is marvellous. 1-0. Lovely. Look at that. Till ever this second of the season. Joint top scorer. Just hits it first time. Come on. I think, um, and many of you guys have said in the comments, that actually this team looks half decent. I think we can go for playoffs this season. It may, I might be saying all this way too early um, and to be fair I haven't really looked to the opposition teams for how good they are but I think it's pretty decent we've made some good pickups if we can settle down with the formation that we like and it works I think we could do well this season Baydakov with a poor free kick but Tilev picks it up we know what damage he can do such as a 30 yard pass back Sarov back to Tilev the danger man flip off Alberto Lugo fires it back. Oh, look at this play. It's beautiful. Lovely pass from the youngster. Through Baydakov. Oh! <laughs> I don't know what happened to the guy. <laughs> the goalkeeper's legs just stopped working. He just sort of crumpled. Look. He looked like he was going to dive. Watch the goalkeeper here. He looks like he's going to dive for it. Right? It's not the hardest shot in the world. Oh, no. And his, his legs... He's going to dive, but his legs went... Nope. Two nil, comfortable, creating good chances, ish. I've got a text. Should we see who the text is from? It's from Daryl Swinnerton and two others have left a comment on my video. Thank you very much, guys. Big shout out. There you go. You're famous now. Right, lovely Tilev. He's involved in everything. Lovely ball. Keepers come out for it and he's missed it. And Alberto Lugo with his first of the season and it's 3-0. And I think we've answered the question, does this tactic work against the shit teams? Yes. If you were wondering. Yes, 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 it does. Just in case the 3-0 wasn't clear. Right. Loving life at the moment, boys. Keep on trucking. Oh, they don't know what's hit them. Bloody marvellous. That was one of the best halves we've had. Created good chances. Lovely bit of passing. Spreading the goals and assists rounds. I'm very happy with that. Carry on. Right, Zappers. He's had a quiet game. We've not seen much of Zappers. Lovely. Look at that. From the kickoff. It's just silky stuff. Arsenal-esque. Why have I got a dog hair? Hanging from my hand. The fucking dog hairs everywhere. Three dogs. It's just... I don't know how three dogs can produce that much dog hair. I just don't understand it. I brush them very regularly. And yet still. It's like a thin film 
over everything in my house is dog hair. I can I can get a parcel from Amazon, open it up, and there's my dog hair in it. Already, it seeps into everything. And now Vassils. Oh, Vaseline. Oh, Vaseline. Yes, somebody suggested Vaseline. I think we'll call him Vaseline. Because he's slippery. <laughs> and he's good for up the bum. No, because he's slippery. Right, we can probably give the debut to our new guy. We need to get him some uh, matchy sharpy sharpness, I think it's called. Um, I'm not sure what... He's a defensive midfielder, isn't he? I think he's best as a ball winner, but we can train him as a defensive. He's got the stats for it, so... Right, um, anybody else? Anybody else? We've got 20 minutes left. We might as well go for a, a triple sub. Um, he's getting rested. He's getting rested. We could go for Jordanov. Jordanov is the deep line playmaker. Rest the youngster, I think. Yep, yep, yep. We're good to go. Good to go. Just learning the player's name. It always takes a little bit of time. Alright, see it out. Don't need any more goals. We don't want to show off. Oh, go on then. Spoil us. Spoil us with another tricky one. Hoofed ball in. Cleared away. Flip off. Who's had a good game? Alberto Lugo. Savov. Oh, it's lovely. Look at this. Beautiful play. Yordanov. To Avramov. Back to Flipov. Back to Avramov. Yordanov. Back to. Shit, who's he? Grammitikovnskis, Alberto Lugo, Savov. Oh, this is this is disgusting, people. We're making a mockery out of them at the moment. Flipov, Beidakov, Zappers. It stands out now, Zappers, doesn't it? Beda oh, it's a penalty. It's a penalty. They just couldn't get the ball off us. And they just got fed up. Somebody had a lunge. Now we know what good penalty takers we've got, guys. I think Beidakov is our best penalty taker with eight one fat lady, eight penalty takers. Not eight penalty taking. Doesn't matter. He's going to put it away. Bottom right. Bottom right all day long. Top right, as I called it. Didn't go in. What? It didn't go in. <laughs> didn't go in, did it? I celebrated and everything. That's not... It's a little bit awkward. Right. Right, Savolf. Lovely. We're going to get a cheeky fourth. I, th I was sure that went in. I was so sure that went in. <laughs> so much so that I want to go and rewatch it. But then I'm like, well, no, it didn't go in because it wasn't a goal. <sighs> right. That's a good win, though. That gives us a little bit of breathing space over um, the old relegation battle. Because at the end of the day, that's what we're supposedly supposed to be in. So that's first, first job at hand. Not to get relegated. Tilev is amazing let's praise him we want to keep him at the club as long as possible so he has got a 250 grand release clause because that's all i could get in on him um but that would still set us up for a good couple of season that 250 grand your passing was okay he doesn't no. i'm glad you can do better then i play it a lot better if you just oh fucking why do people get pissed off when you give him a compliment in this fucking game <sighs> I'm, not, I'm not angry just disappointed right eighth in the league we're three points off the playoffs. We are currently eight points off the relegation. We're cruising along nicely. Brilliant stuff. Hello, there you go. That'll sum up the episode, Alex. Not too bad. Thank you very much for joining me, guys. Please do hit that like button. I'm going to... Oh, I'm going... Fuck it. Let's go big. Go big, go home. 500 likes I want this video. 500 likes, okay? We normally do about 250, right? I was going to say, so prove me wrong, but then it just looks like I'm doing the old... <laughs> switcheroo thing isn't it aha uh -huh. prove me right and you'll look ah oh, like it and oh fun you can have right i love you all very much bye bye